little while, but now a new piece of artwork is creating a lot of buzz in Encinitas. It is a stained glass mosaic of a surfing Madonna that just appeared in an unlikely spot. The mosaic was installed right before Earth Day by a group of men posing as construction workers. Jeff Zedley is live in Encinitas with a story. Jeff? Well, Carlo, the Carter of Cook may have some competition because Our Lady of Guadalupe just surfed herself right onto the front page of the paper. This piece of artwork is amazing to touch and to look at, and although she looks so good on that surfboard, she may be heading towards a wipeout. I think it's just beautiful. Thousands of tiny pieces of stained glass have created one big problem for the city of Encinitas. I'm speechless. <laughs> the verdict is unanimous. Everybody loves this illegal piece of art. I think it's beautiful. I think it's a phenomenal piece. A few days before Easter, this surfing Madonna, a vision of the Virgin Mary, Our Lady Guadalupe, mysteriously appeared. It's something that needs to be preserved. The problem is, nobody knows who made it or how well it's been installed underneath the bridge. With the train rumbling by overhead, there's a fear that all that glass could fall on somebody. People are afraid of this, right here. Here's your camera shot. People are <laughs> afraid feeding. of this. Yeah. But what you get is this, and that's just terrific. The bridge belongs to the North County Transit District, the sidewalk to Encinitas, so they could be held liable if anything goes wrong. And there's another problem, the mixing of religious art on public land. I believe she's praying for the beach to save, save the beach. Although the mosaic reads, save the ocean, it's also Catholic-based, something artists Chris Adams thinks the city should embrace. We allow everything else, why can't it be religious? Yeah, at best, it's awkward. James Bond, the mayor of Encinitas, doesn't think the religious theme will be a problem, but the city has a process for selecting public art, and whoever put this up didn't ask for permission. No one's going to rush out there and tear it down, though it does really meet the uh, criteria for graffiti era. Mayor Bond says, look all around. The city of Encinitas loves its public art, including the new tiki-headed swamis. But when artists break the rules, they get a chilly reception even when the surfing Madonna is wearing booties to keep her feet warm. I love that. <laughs> it's a beautiful piece. I say they should protect it and, and skip the red tape, leave it up for people to enjoy. Coming up new at 6.30, if Our Lady of Guadalupe has to go, where will she move? You're going to meet the lady who is first in line with an idea that everyone might just love. That story coming up new at 6.30. You know, Jeff, I was driving by there today and I popped in to say hi to you and I was amazed at the amount of attention this piece of artwork is getting. People were taking pictures from their cars, they were pulling over, they were getting out to try and take a picture like I did. I mean, it really has created a lot of buzz. Uh, you know, Barbara Lee, you say that and right behind Mike Edison, if you just do see -do, more people are showing up by the minute and a lot of the ideas we're hearing out here, why can't the city just put up a large piece of industrial plexiglass and just encase all of this? That's one idea that's being floated. Also, an artist just showed up and he said, you know what, if they try to pry this off, they're going to break this. So that's something to watch out for. You know, much more on this story coming up at 630. All right, we look forward to it. Thanks, Jeff.